Hi, I'm sitting here with Brendan Thomas and the Vibes, who you'll know from placing third on X Factor New Zealand. How are you guys? Very good. Yeah? yeah. You just finished touring with I Am Giant. How was that? The best thing we've ever done so far. <laughs> it was like the most fun and it was just playing to a lot of people and spreading our music, which was beautiful. Is touring as glamorous as it's made out to be? Nah, it's rough. It's rough, <laughs> it's rough the whole time, but it's you know it's worth it. You it's, go to jam. Yeah, it's got its glamour bits. Yeah. In the in the way that we play on a very fancy stage with a lot of lights and a lot of people. Would you recommend entering a music competition? Yeah, I guess we did it because it was the first time they were like calling bands, and we're like, oh no, we're not going to do this. Like, but um, our manager at the time, my mate Liam, was like, just just do it for like. TV exposure. Exposure is a real big thing to just try to get out there. It's very different from being a musician on, in normal terms, you know? Yeah. It's like sort of glammed up a lot. There is a lot of weird, like if you do something really cool, they want you to get like another angle of that and like, that oh, kind wow. of buzz. You're it's like, so strange. It's weird recreating a moment, but um, you get over it and you realise they're, they're trying to make a good TV show and you're just, there's no point fighting with that, just let it be and just focus on the music. So for your next EP, do you think it'll be similar to your first album or should we expect something else? Yeah, um, the EP went well because it was on the show when number one and stuff was really cool. Through working with other producers and writers, which I'm all for because there's a lot like we have to learn in terms of um, radio because we're, we're quite a jam band, not necessarily a radio band. And that's what we're trying to form a bridge between. And it's, it's actually really exciting to be honest because uh, there's a lot that can be used and utilised and developed in terms of what we sound like. What's been the highlight of your band's life so far? Probably playing Vector Arena for me. At, well, on X Factor, which is, that's what I'm saying, there's a lot of beautiful stuff that can come out of it. For at boot camp, we played in front of like 5,000 people at Vector Arena and just walking out there hearing this like rumbling was just, this is like a feeling I've never ever like had before. How do you guys prepare for live shows? Yeah. Feel bad because like all these bands ask us like, what is your ritual before you go on stage yeah. and stuff? And I'm like, man, we must be really chill because all we do is like, sweet, ready? Yeah. <laughs> and, then, got this. and then maybe like yeah, dive maybe. into each other and stuff if it's really yeah. big game, we like yeah, slam into each started. other and just like just push each other around and stuff just to like, you know, get the blood flowing and stuff. Yeah. So do you have any just overall tips for people who want to succeed like you have? Yeah, just, I mean, just jam everywhere possible. you got to get used to the bad gigs. Yeah, at of the course. Start as well, oh, man. And learn not to complain. You'll, you'll um, play to like just the bartenders, yeah. eh? Sometimes they'll leave and yeah. it's just <laughs> you in the bar. As long as you're doing it because you're actually enjoying playing music, not because of anything else, you know? <laughs>